when um, components are in series they have to share the current this is really important to note for a few reasons when we're actually connecting um, circuits say in houses or in other other places if we want our um, components to get the full amount of voltage that's supplied by the, the um, power supply, um, we want to connect them in parallel. Otherwise, if we have our components in series, they will have to share that voltage, which might not be ideal for their situation. The other disadvantage about series circuits is if one component goes out, that has broken the, the whole circuit and none of those components will work. The advantage of these circuits are that we're not going to overload it if we add more components. They'll simply have to share the amount of voltage and therefore the current will go down as well. When we have a parallel circuit, as we can see here, each component can get the full amount of voltage, which is a real advantage. Say in a kitchen, if we were to have a fridge and a stove and a microwave all connected in series, we'd have to have them all on at once if one of them was to go out, we would, they'd all go out, and as well, they would all have to share the voltage, meaning none of them would work to their capacity. However, the disadvantage of these, series, of these circuits in parallel is that we can actually overload them by connecting too many components, um, and that, will, that can actually lead to a shortage. The other disadvantage is we also need more wires, as you can see, to connect two globes. We need four wires instead of three.